Okay, so we are headed out toward the Jordan Craters. Uh, we were trying to go to the Cow Lakes campground, but it is not an option the way that we went. So, um, we, sorry, going through the water. Um, so we decided to backtrack just a little bit and go to uh, the crater itself or just follow the signs out to the crater itself. If you haven't ever seen the Jordan Craters, um, well, maybe we'll see if we can get like a Google Maps image of it, but they are just, it's just this massive like lava flow and you can see it from the satellite pictures. It's just this like massive black rock out here uh, near Jordan Valley. So uh, we saw it like what? A year ago, two years ago, something or something like, like that. that. Yeah. We're like, man, we gotta go check that out. And uh, we're just finally doing it. We have a, uh, some friends from Payat that we're uh, headed out here with, and we'll see how it goes. Uh, it is currently 25 degrees, and our sleeping bag is a 20 degree sleeping bag quilt thing. So hopefully, we don't freeze to death tonight. Yeah, that's, that's there the is snow along the road, so. <laughs> out here it's freezing cold but we are in a gravel pit I don't even know if you can see it yeah a big gravel pit we found not make it to the craters so last night was a little eventful it was super cold and windy um, but we made it we got in the back and got to sleep in and uh, did okay we had some heated up Nalgene bottles and had the dogs in there to snuggle with and each other there to snuggle <laughs> with and got warm enough that we could go to sleep. Uh, this morning we're here. And we're gonna put everybody in the pickup and head into the craters. There's some pretty serious snow in between here and there. So, so the road didn't go where we thought it would. Just ends up going around the whole crater system. So we decided to park and hike our way in and check out what we found. We're hiking down by this creek through this little canyon, trying not to get cliffed out. There's this cool little waterfall back there. Cute little Sadie's coming down. How cold is it, Sadie's? Very cold, 20 degrees. <laughs> oh man, sun coming up over here. Dogs are loving it. So I'll try to be a little bit quiet right here. But the water is running underneath all these rocks. And it's really like rumbly. Listen. Out there's a huge lava flow. So excited to get on top of it, see what it feels like. So we finally made it down here to the flow. Check this out. That is so cool. There are these cool fissures in the rock. This one may not be quite as impressive, but wow, that goes down there a long way. So I made it inside of this cave. This is so sick. Yeah. The snow kind of drops into it. You can see it. Sam's very concerned. Icicles and stuff down here. You listen to this. I've actually had to be careful because there's like sinkholes out here. So we went out there onto the lava field and that was super cool. We found a little cave and uh, it's just really different, really different than anything you're on or that we're on normally. Um, some of it kind of reminded me of the ocean. Some of it was just lava flow. It kind of feels like you're walking around on a giant brownie or something. <laughs> and uh, 
Anyways, that was good. We came back and and we actually split up. Um, Mercedes and Caitlin came back and started breakfast, and then Zach and I walked around for a little bit with the dogs and saw some more stuff. And uh, got back together, started making breakfast, and, and like got breakfast made. And we we're eating breakfast. It was really tasty. I had some potatoes with green peppers and onions and eggs and cheese. And oh man, it was good. Um, anyway, ate breakfast and then. Um, it started snowing on us and we're looking at this like wall of snow coming at us. I was like, uh, I think we might need to leave. And Mercedes was like, yep, let's go. Anyway, so we're now with the pickup and we'll show you the snow. Oh yeah, and there have been a ton of these water crossings coming in here. I didn't really think there would be, but there's been a bunch, like five or six. More than that, I feel More like. More than that, yeah. yeah. There's been a bunch. Yeah. You should have counted. <laughs> I'm glad Sam's foot wasn't actually hurt.